Welcome back, Halo followers. Today we got some exciting news. Some classic armor is coming to Halo 3 and Halo 2 Anniversary. Firstly, I want to talk about the lore behind this armor and exactly what we're getting because we're getting quite a bit of stuff for Halo 2 Anniversary as well as Halo 3. So be sure to stay tuned, hit that like button, and subscribe. Join me on the journey of following Halo. So yes, let's first talk about this armor. It's called Mirage. It's actually SPI armor. A little bit of lore for you. Basically, this is not the full suit of Mani or Power Armor. This is kind of like a substitute version of it. It is not as powerful, and a lot of Spartan 3s actually use this armor on suicide missions. They lacked energy shield generators in the compact fusion reactors on Monier, but actually dozens or hundreds of SPR armor could be produced for the cost of a single suit of, of Mark IV armor. So yeah, a lot of Spartan 3s died in this armor, and this is actually coming to Halo 3. Very, very cool. That includes helmet, chest, shoulders, arms, and a leg piece. We also have the Orion armor coming to Halo 2 Anniversary's customization in MCC. Now, just so you know, this was actually first seen back in Macworld pre-Halo 1 gameplay. So it's a very iconic thing, especially since Halo is about to be 20 years old in just a few days here. This is really cool, very iconic, and it's so cool to actually see this actually going to be playable in a modern Halo game, right? But there is actual official Halo lore added with this armor now, so it's great to see that this has actually made it into the canon. Essentially, essentially, as you might have guessed, this is Spartan 1 armor. As you might know, Major Avery Johnson was one of the Spartan 1s, was one of the prototypes for the Spartan 2 program, and actually got into this armor himself, but it was a prototype that never really got worked out. But it will be in Halo 2 Anniversary, including the helmet, chest, shoulders, arms, and legs. We actually have a whole timeline of stuff releasing here, and there is just a lot of content. November 3rd, we are getting the Halo 2 Anniversary multiplayer armor, which we have already have in MCC now. Um, but on November 10th, we're actually getting Duke Shoulders and Halo 3 multiplayer, and also the original Xbox console on our back. November 17th, we get a special AR. November 24th, we get the Mirage armor for Halo 3. And then we also have the uh, special BR and a rucksack coming to Halo 3 multiplayer. December 8th, that's the day Halo Infinite releases. So soon, right? That is when we get this little container on Halo Reach. December 15th, we get some other customization items for Halo 3 multiplayer. Uh, December 22nd, we get a Grunt plushie, another backpack. December 29th, a few different skins. And then on January 5th, the return of the Ryan armor. I should have also mentioned that this is all coming to the exchange. This is stuff that you will, you will have to actually be on MCC that specific day if you want to purchase it with your season points. So, yeah, this is really cool stuff, guys. I just want to say thanks 3 for 3 for bringing this stuff in. The only thing I ask, honestly, is to bring that Orion over into Halo 3 because I do believe that Halo 3 has been kind of like the centerpiece of MCC. Everyone kind of flocks to it. So I would like to see all the stuff that wasn't in, in Halo 3 going to be over in Halo 3 at some point. That's all I, I hope here. We also have a couple nameplates. Um, these are all cool, but the one that really stands out is that Mr. Paperclip guy, which I thought was hilarious. Uh, I definitely got to get my hands on that guy. Very funny, very great. And uh, guys, thanks so much for watching. Again, be sure to smash that like button blue if you enjoy the news and find it helpful. And I'll catch you guys in the next one soon. Peace.